guys. So we're back at work. Um, changing rooms. There's not really much to say, to be honest. Uh, oh gosh, my hair. <laughs> um, yeah, just a quick kind of hello, welcome to welcome to work. I'm not 100% awake still. Um, I just do like big ass time lapses of like service and stuff. Um, <clears throat> it's it's a Tuesday today, so it's gonna be pretty quiet. Hopefully, I don't actually know what. I've been off for the past four days, so I don't really know what's gonna be going on. But yeah, we'll see. Until then. Hi, Katarina. Nice holiday. Yeah, this is the kitchen. Uh, it's pretty, it's pretty great considering like like today. Um, I know, I'm gonna pop like crazy. Hello, Wiggy. Don't swear on my video, it's rude. Well, Sorry. Don't swear it is, it's rude. This is the rest. Well, this is kind of like. Hello, dear. Hi, chef. We're doing a video. That's my sous chef. Say hi, Lee. It's a video, say hi. It's really rude. Sorry, guys. Pastry kitchen and this is the crack kitchen. It's a bit of a shit hole at the moment. Ooh. Sorry, it's a bit of a hole at the moment. But, yeah. What up, guys? I nearly recorded this as a time lapse, which would have been mildly hilarious because <laughs> I might actually like add at the end of this video a video of me doing a thing but as a time lapse instead so you can see exactly how hilarious it would be. Yeah, that was that was what you should have should have seen if I've edited this properly. Um was my kitchen. Damn I look tired. Um yeah. That is that is my kitchen. I love it. It is it's home to me. I can't imagine being anywhere else. I love the guys I work with. But today has been so incredibly dead. We um we didn't do a lot, I'll put it that way. So it's just been a lot of kind of cleaning and standing around. Which, I mean, it's kind of par for the course. There's a kind of a, a line, if you can lean, you can clean. Um, which basically means there's always something to do. You've always got a job that needs doing. Whether it be prep, service, cleaning, go find other jobs that other people can do. I think that that's one of the things I really learned is it, it, it's made me a lot it, it's made me a lot more selfless and willing to help others and also a lot less tolerant of people's stupidity um like today without naming names we uh, we were we were confronted by a very impatient customer I'll put it that way and it kind of it made me love the fact that I'm I'm personally back of house which means I don't really deal with customers I just deal with the waiters and the servers and the runners who are front of house who do deal with the customers so basically the, the, I feel for them because they get shouted at by the customers and by us because we think they're all idiots um, mm. if you've ever dated a chef or know a chef or know someone who works in the kitchen you'll know what that means um but by and large, we are a loving bunch when it comes down to it. Um, one of the boys is leaving next week, uh, and I'm I'm wanting to do, I'm wanting to play play a little prank on him. Um, but I've actually never worked anywhere. I've always been the first one to leave, through no fault of my own, by the way. So if you have any ideas, comments, anything, just let me know. Let me com drop me a comment, drop me an email, whatever, um, and I will try and if we do anything, I will try and video his reaction for you. Until next time, guys. Adios.